Every day we are required to make choices, some of which contradict our beliefs, and it is this contradiction that may result in cognitive dissonance. Cognitive dissonance is defined as the stress that comes from holding two conflicting thoughts simultaneously in the mind, usually arising when people are asked to choose between two options. So, what are the emotional effects of making a choice that contradicts your values and beliefs? Firstly, theories such as the circumplex model of effect and neural mechanisms of cognitive dissonance can help us understand this interaction. The basis of the circumplex model of effect is that a person's affective experience can be categorised by ordering affective states on the circumference of a circle with two dimensions, pleasure and displeasure and arousal. Cognitive dissonance has been found to increase negative effect and decrease positive effect, showing a person's affective states being on opposing sides of the circle. The emotional effects of cognitive dissonance may also be explained from a neuropsychological perspective. Dissonance-inducing situations showed increased neural activation in key brain regions, including the dorsal anterior cingulate cortex, the left anterior insula, the inferior frontal gyrus, and precuneus. Similar brain regions have been found to be activated when shame, guilt and regret occur. The dorsolateral prefrontal cortex and the precuneus area are activated by guilt and shame and regret has been found to activate the anterior insula. Let's now look at the specific emotional effects of cognitive dissonance, including guilt, shame and regret. Guilt is a self-conscious emotion activated by a breach in internal moral standards. Empirical research on ethical consumption choices has found that guilt is induced by cognitive dissonance. A choice such as unethical consumption provokes cognitive dissonance. Guilt is then a result of this dissonance and in order to reduce this discomfort, subsequent ethical consumption choices are made. Next, shame. Shame is a result of a negative estimation of one's behaviour. A study examining the effects of cognitive dissonance on religion and sexuality gives insight into the role of dissonance in maintaining shame. Cognitive dissonance is induced due to conflicting homosexual and religious thoughts and this results in the maintenance of internalised shame. Finally, regret has been defined as a negative emotion which arises after poor decision making. When looking at regret and dissonance, Post-purchase dissonance negatively influenced repurchase intention and post-purchase satisfaction, resulting in strong feelings of guilt. Reducing dissonance is essential in order to try and restore emotional well-being and there are three suggested ways to do so. Firstly, changing one of the dissonant elements such as personal values, opinions or behaviours. Secondly, decreasing the importance of a consonant belief. Or finally, adding a new consonant belief. I encourage you to see if you experience any other emotional effects of cognitive dissonance.